Hey, good morning YouTube. Chris here with Jarvis Outdoors. I uh, stopped by uh, the camper this morning to take care of a little unique situation and I wanted to share it with you because I'm sure I'm not the only one having this problem. So what we have is a 2017 uh, Rockwood high wall pop-up camper uh, model 276. Uh, we love it. It's been great. Um, we just got it this year and started using it. We went on about five camping trips and I've run into a situation with the gray water and black water uh, drains. So our black water tank drain has a three inch uh, hub style bayonet uh, connection and it allows us to hook up, leave it connected and it drains properly. Um, where we run into the problem is my gray water tank drain has a inch and a half threaded male and the sewer hose will not connect to it so um you have to hold it in place we've had some problems with it leaking um and it, it's just a, a mess i mean the gray water is not you know uh, as bad a problem as you know black water sewer water but it's still nasty it still can be a mess so um, i went to the rv store uh, up the street the other day and explained the situation to them about how my connections were not combined into one drain and the guy was kind of puzzled so um he said he had never heard of that, but uh, I've done some research since I left there, and it seems like the, this style pop-up and maybe a few others, I'm not sure what other brands, uh, have separate connections. So um, I asked him if there was an adapter or something I could use, and he didn't have anything for me. So he handed me a book uh, where I could order some uh, uh, pipe parts and adapters and everything. Um, and I found something that would work, but it was going to cost me like $40 uh, plus shipping. And then the thing was going to be over 12 inches long. So it was going to be hanging out the side of the RV or the camper. And it just wasn't what I wanted. So I got onto Amazon, started looking. Uh, and what I found was a 3-inch bayonet connection to a 3-inch slip hub connection. Uh, I ordered it on the Amazon. It was like five seventy-five, dollars um, shipped in a couple days. So then I got with a plumber friend who said, I said I need to go from the three inch slip hub to uh, something and he said that we could use a three inch to inch and a half uh, reducer bushing. So that was, that solved the next problem. So then I said, well I need to connect into the inch and a half male threaded male and he said well we can get a uh, inch and a half uh, female threaded street adapter and this was actually the hardest part to find um, but we got these two parts at Home Depot so I found on Amazon you can buy the the inch and a half to three inch uh, reducer bushing on Amazon but I, the only place I've been able to find this uh, street adapter was Home Depot Lowe's so the uh, the reducer bushing was about 375 and the street adapter was two bucks so all said and done I'm like you know less than 15 bucks in everything so I asked him if there was a problem going from the black pipe to the white PVC regular and he said that we needed to use this hot medium blue lava PVC cement and we wouldn't have any issues so that's what we did so let me show you uh, what we're working with here and why we needed to do this. So, excuse me, I'm out here using my phone today. So here's my inch and a half uh, threaded male gray water drain. And here over here is my three inch hub style um, uh, black water drain. So if we wanna drain the black water tank, all I do is take this cap off and hook up, twist it on there, lock it, and I pull it. Well then where I ran into the problem is when I want to use this, this does not fit to this. So I had this is where this comes into play, the adapter. So this will screw on and you can leave this on. And then I left this apart just so I could show you guys. I am gonna uh, PVC cement it together. That'll go on there. And then this can lock on. 
and you can drain it by pulling the valve and now I can drain the gray water without any leaks and I can uh, without any leaks it'll flush help me flush out the black water out of the, um, the sewer hose so I've ordered also on Amazon another uh, three inch cap so I can leave this on and what this has achieved what I wanted it's a small short adapter it's sitting about six inches back in behind the uh, the side of the camper it's not hanging out it was only about fifteen dollars and that includes the glue and it's something I can leave on there uh, leave on or take off I can take it off whatever because it's so easily you know just threads on and we're good to go. So that has solved my problem. So, and it was cheap, it was easy, it just took a little research to do. And now I can easily, without any mess, drain the gray water uh, tank. And uh, by doing that, I can flush the sewer hose. So uh, I'm sure I'm not the only one having this problem, but I wanted to share it because I uh, figured somebody else would uh, think it was great what I'll do is I will post in the description below I will post a um, link to the Amazon for the uh, the adapter the three inch bayonet style to uh, three inch slip hub uh, I will put, uh, put in there the um, three inch to inch and a half reducer bushing and then I'll also uh, like I said it'll be have to be a link to Home Depot um, or Lowe's uh, the uh, link for the inch and a half street female adapter so and then I can also put in uh, the PVC cement and the cap that I ordered for it so uh, I hope this helps somebody because like I said it took a little bit of research but uh, I think it'll work out well uh, it's gonna be mess free and easy and it's cheap like I said less than 15 bucks and we're up and running so actually once you uh, add the cap on it'll probably be a little more but that's still a lot better than forty dollars for something that wasn't gonna work the way I wanted it to work so uh, if you haven't already, uh, please subscribe to our channel. If you like the uh, video, give it a thumbs up and um, we'll have more content coming out soon. So thanks for watching and uh, definitely appreciate the time.